What's up, Mercs? It's Joe here with some more Fallout Frost. Last time we found the K-21B Surveillance Center, and today we're heading to the Coast Guard Pier, so... Let's get a move on. Now, as you can see, I did find my way out, and, well, there's nothing really out here. It's just an elevator that leads to the surface, sadly. Either way, let's get out of the glowing sea as fast as possible before a rad storm that can kill me sweeps in. It is pretty early in the morning, yeah, it's 527, and our target location is the Coast Guard Pier there. Because we now have the Coast Guard password. Now, it is possible that the Coast Guard Pier is not what I'm looking for. It's possible that I'm looking for some sort of Coast Guard HQ or something, but I have a feeling this Coast Guard Pier is the HQ, because, I mean, that's all I can think of. Oh, what is that? Oh, that's weird. That's all I can think of at the moment that would be Coast Guard related, so I'm gonna assume we're going the right way. If not, we'll figure it out, but we should be fine. Let's go ahead and take another Rad away. I do have Rad X currently on too. We'll eat some Bear Ribs because we are famished. Oh, we're out of Bear Ribs. We'll actually just eat our Death Claw steak then. And we're a bit thirsty, but that's okay. We are weary. Which is unfortunate, just because of how much Radex and Radaway we have to use. It's crazy, but we are almost, almost out of Glowing Sea, and hopefully for good. Because this place is horrible. I don't ever want to return. We might have to in the future. I don't know. We'll see where the quest takes us, but I think we'll be okay. I hope we'll be okay. And it looks like we're actually at less than one Rads, which means... We made it. We're out of the glowing sea. Please give me a save. In fact, I think I'm just gonna go ahead and get rid of my weariness now. This might only get me to overtired, but it's better than weary. Uh, let's see what it gave me. Okay, it just gave me tired, not overtired. Good. Good. And we're not in a terribly green thing. We're in a relatively nice winter wonderland. How fitting. We're good, though. We're out of the glowing sea. It's quiet. Just listen. You hear that? Just the wind. No storms, no lightning, no thunder. Just the wind. I love it. Peace and quiet after being in the glowing sea for so long. Oh, that's that's peaceful and quiet. Just a legendary death claw. Yep, that's exactly what I wanted right about now. I don't think it's going to see me if I walk here. Let's just get out of there. I want to try and get to the Coast Guard Pier as fast as possible. Because I'm pretty excited to see what I actually find there. If it ends up that the Coast Guard Pier is not the target location, we're going to head south along the river. Because, you know, Coast Guard you would expect to be on the river. If there's another Coast Guard building. And we'll see if we can't find it. But again, I'm pretty sure this is it. I'm pretty sure the key that we found is for that little thing that we couldn't get access to before. But I don't know, because I could have hacked it if I had hacking. So wouldn't that just bypass the quest? Like, I don't know. Maybe you can bypass the quest. and Maybe hacking is a lot better than I think it is if you could bypass the entire glowing sea part with it. I'm not sure. I really have no idea. Okay, this is the mass fusion disposal site we're coming up to. I want to be careful. Because I don't want to go into the center of it. Whoa. It's got super foggy. Oh, it's the water. Yeah, I don't want to go too close to that. I don't want to get any excess radiation. We're already kind of trying to die down what we currently have gotten. In fact, I'm going to drink the bourbon I have. Since I have Party Boy anyway. Just kind of start working that radiation off very slowly. Don't want to take any rat away. Because that stuff just completely screws with your system. But, you know, alcohol always helps. You know, I wish, like, let me just double check. Does it? Where's Camboy here? Or whatever. Not Camboy, it's Party Boy. What was the one? Uh, Chem Resistant. Yeah, this is just like, this just with Chem Addiction. And then there's stuff with alcohol. There's what there should be. And this is just a suggestion. I wish there was a perk that kind of toned down the effects of the side effects. Or the, okay, the effects of the side. I wish it toned down the side effects of things. Like how Radaway right tires you out, makes you dehydrated or hungry. I can't remember which what it does. And suppresses your immune system. I wish it like kind of toned that down. You know? That'd be really cool. There's a perk that 
took away side effects. Granted, that would be a fucking stupid powerful perk, especially when you combine it with, you know, Party Boy and Chem Resistant, but it'd be an interesting thought. I don't know. Maybe now that I think about it, yeah, it does seem way too powerful. Electrical Hobbyists Club. Cool. Guess we'll check it out. Oh, God, radiation! Whoa! Ugh! Never mind. I don't care for your generator thing. I'm good. What is that? What is that? Oh, no, that's nothing. But that's what's giving me the radiation. Yeah, I'm not even bothering. Nope. 30 a second? Fuck no. I'm not even going near that. Not anymore. Mm-mm. No, 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 no. I'm good. I'm not taking the chance. And I think this is the river? So the Coast Guard's like... Oh, yeah. Okay, we're really close. Coast Guard's right there. It's hard to see because it's so foggy, but we're there. I hope I'm in the right spot because I don't know where else to look after this. Come on, dogs. We'll just take it with the Chinese officer sword. We got three of them, I think, I counted. Come on! Oh, that was less than ideal, but it went okay. And last one, there we go, into the water. Nice. Nice. Any others? I still didn't fix my hotkey, by the way, so I had to click zero on my keyboard, keyboard, my keyboard to use my bandages. I forgot to fix the hotkey on my mouse. I It just completely, like, left my brain last time. The second I stopped, I didn't even think about it, but whatever. Let's go ahead and make sure we vats a little bit. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. More ghouls, which also means there could be more frag mines. Don't want to run into a frag mine. I gotta be careful. Oh, hello. Shit. Oh, I. Uh, yeah, that's what I meant to do. Can you guys not get me? I don't. Yeah, I meant to do this. Hmm. Oh, what? You bastard! You son of a bitch! Oh my god! <laughs> Alright, let's do this the right way. Alright, thanks boys. Appreciate it. Another one coming. There we go. good. Alright, could have gone worse. Just look out for mines. Bit of money, come on, there you go. Toy alien, no, okay. Let's see if this passcode works down here. I hope it does. Doesn't. Hmm. Wait! That just opened, though. Oh, that's for that. Fuck! Can't break the code. This isn't it. Well, at least that's not it. There might be something else around here. Any winter? I have to open that safe, too. Huh. This is the Coast Guard? Shit, I was really afraid of this. It's in the- it's in the glowing sea, isn't it? It's in the fucking glowing sea. Hmm. <sighs> God damn it. I really don't want to go back there. I don't have enough radix and rad- well, I do, but I- <sighs> just hate going in there. Maybe it's in here? 
Psycho, Blood Pack. I know there's still some. Ooh, Missile Turret. I know there's still something I have to lock, babe. Don't worry, I'll get to it. What about in here, maybe? Doesn't look like we're gonna find it. What is it called again? The Coast Guard. What? Coast Guard database password. The Coast Guard database? I mean, I guess there's some other things we could search. Could be in here. This is a locked door. Nice. Oh, that was a gun trap. I think I ran like after it went off. It's like a little late then, buddy. A little bit late. Hmm. Fuck. <laughs> I'm stumped. I mean, I'm not stumped. We're gonna head south because it said it was east of, of where we were, so... It, it shouldn't be too hard to find, it's just... Unless there is something in here that I'm missing? No, this is just the logs. Yeah, son of a bitch, man. I really had to have a feeling that this wasn't gonna be it. Unless, no, there's no terminals in there that I can activate. Might be able to hack this. That's just the evidence locker. Okay. All right. Well, that's fine. We still have a lead. Okay. We'll head south from here and we'll see what we can find. There's a chance it's still in the glowing sea. I'm gonna try and avoid the glowing sea and look everywhere besides the glowing sea first. Got it. Maybe then I can get some more supplies for the glowing sea, but also I think there might be something over here. Oh. Hey look, it's a lockup password. I wonder how I knew that was there. There's a barnacle down there that almost hit me too. Thanks to the birdies in the comments. He told me about that, by the way. Really appreciate it. <laughs> yes, we're in now. But this isn't what we're looking for. If only I found this before, right? I would have known that this is not what we're looking for. <sighs> Why didn't I just remember this? Whatever. We got this stuff at least. At least it's something, right? We got guns. Wait, combat. Is that a pipe one? No, it's a 308 combat sniper rifle. Wow. 126 damage versus. Wow, that's a lot more damage. Oh, but this is 308. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. It's a lot more damage. Whoa, that's a lot of ammo. Holy shit. What? Oh, my God. I just picked up like 60 rounds. Oh, man. I'm definitely going to keep with the bolt action. I don't want to use that too much. Holy shit. Yes, please. Thank you. But we'll follow the river down south and we'll see what we can find. Yes. We're still looking for a Coast Guard thing, so I would imagine it's connected to some body of water. It could be on the coast, which... Oh, you know what? Hmm... That's it. I'm gonna go and assume that the thing we're looking for is on the coast somewhere. We're gonna head straight east. So we'll go down here, we'll check out all of this, and then we'll head straight east from that, and then we'll check out the coast. Th why would- uh, think about it, okay? Where would the coast guard be? What's more likely? On the river? Or on the ocean? Yeah, the ocean. It's the coast. Ah, I'm dead! I fucking hate frag mines. I really do. I really fucking do. How much progress did I just lose? Just lost a ton of progress, didn't I? Just a ton. I don't even want to look up. Oh! Oh, I'm all the way over here. Am I even close? Oh, fuck me! Oh! I'm... I'll be right back. Okay, well, now that I'm back here, I'm kind of glad I died because, wow, I would have missed some huge shit. People who know about the quest are probably screaming in the comments, 
like mid video that I'm missing this. I'm so sorry. <laughs> we found it though. So let's see what this has to say. Ship trafficking X47003. Ship FMS Columbia, coordinates 23, negative 14, northwest of Spectacle Island. Reason for inquiry, suspected tries to over wait, ties to overseas smuggling ring, cargo to be seized upon docking. X46912. Ship Liberty 6, coordinates 18-4, docked, Boston Bay. Reason for inquiry, suspected ties to oversee a smuggling ring, cargo is seized upon docking. Post inquiry, ship empty, no communist propaganda or weapons. Please remember to delete this entry. We don't want the press or how, knowing how many random searches we've been conducting lately. X32305, era data corruption. We did just get a location of the FMS Columbia back at Spectacle Island. Oh, and here's Major- oh my god, Major- Major Arthur Gannon, sir- Oh my god, I can just- the comments. I really hope people- Oh my god, you guys were probably so pissed for the first half of this video. <laughs> I, if, if I were you guys, I'd be fucking screaming at the monitor. Holy shit. <laughs> I'm so oblivious. Alright. A account of the New England Commonwealth year 2082, as penned by Gannon A. I broke the news to Beth today. They're canceling my assignment and sending me back to e back east to Boston. There's no ETA for my return. I think they mean to keep me out there forever. These last few days on the rig go by too quickly. I find myself recalling all the wonderful moments I've cherished here. The cabin where Beth and I first met, the research libraries where we could read each other's ancient tales of heroism and bravery. Now it's my time to be a hero, though. I wish now it's time it's my time to be a hero, though I wish it wasn't. This mission's the big one. The president himself saw us off. They smiled and waved us, waved as they always do, but I know the deal. They won't let us back until we find their tech. I feel like the king leaving Uruk. More progress. I finally tracked down Bishop. He's hiding out with some old, some of his old crew members up in the hunt. This could be it. News from back west. Beth is pregnant. My wife and unborn son wait a continent away, and all I've got is this lock in a blurry photograph. All this time, the story finally comes together. Iskar was the key, and now I know where the Columbia is, and I know what's waiting for us inside. This is big. Bigger than the Enclave knows. We're moving out immediately. Alright. Wow, we were really close to the FMS Columbia when we were at Spectacle Island. If only we went the opposite direction, huh? Oh boy, mines. Okay, let's go ahead and... Well, first thing I'm gonna do before I save, actually, is spam that so I don't blow myself up. I'm gonna go ahead and loot that interior area again, because I didn't do that. I just got back here, killed all the ghouls, and then started recording again after I found that. God, could you imagine if I didn't die from that fragmine? Could you imagine? Holy shit, this episode... Wow. I'm so glad that didn't trigger me. <laughs> that didn't trigger on me. This would have been one of the worst things I've ever done. And I've done some pretty bad things when it comes to being oblivious to obvious things. Like, holy shit. I'm so thankful I don't have duck and cover right now. Thank you for killing me, mine. I appreciate it. Alright, let's go ahead and access this terminal. Open up the lockup. Get all the ammunition. Just the mag locks. And then straight east we go. To Spectacle Island. We still have a little bit of a base there we can sleep at and kind of- Ooh, this is different loot this time. We can kind of get our bearings and stuff and then we will head out to the FMS Columbia when we have a decent amount of daylight ahead of us. And when we're not tired. I think I- can't remember but I think I might have a framed bed possibly at the Spectacle Island? Yeah, I think we have a framed bed at that outpost we built. It's come full circle, though. All the way back to where we started. Oh my god. Oh. There we go. Fuck me, dude. Antibiotics, bobby pin, duct tape, frag grenades. Okay, cool. Alright, let's go ahead and save real quick. And then... East we go. To... The Spectacle Island, and then to... The FMS Columbia. But yeah, so the FMS Columbia was never in the glowing sea. Okay. It was actually a ship. I, I guess that makes sense. I don't know. Like an FMS... FMS is not a designa designation for a plane. Or a train. Or a truck. Or anything like that. 
unless it's like extremely like like uh, it would have to be something you made up on your own right fms is definitely a designation for a ship so it makes sense so i don't know i just misinterpreted the logs we found either way let's go ahead and mark the wreck of the fms columbia let's head east so i'm wondering what hotel romeo is we know it's a biological weapon we don't know what it does we don't know if we can even use it we don't know what we're gonna do with it once we get it if we can use it i don't know what to expect apparently this place is lived in but oh note look man i ain't going back i'm over 60 for god's sake let me alone I've done well enough over the years. Saved my money. I found a little place in the woods south of the city. I'm going to settle in and enjoy my retirement. Not that any can say that these days. Oh, good for you, buddy. Well, at least his, like, skeleton isn't dead here. So, I, I guess that's a positive. I don't know. Anyway, let's just keep on going. But, um... Yeah, I, I don't know. Because, like... Okay, let's just take it at face value. Uh, that's a bear. We'll come back and explore this stuff when we're not on a quest. Let's take it at face value, though. Let's say it's a biological weapon. Let's say it's a handheld biological weapon. Let's give it that much benefit of the doubt. Let's say it's some sort of modification on the flamer that shoots out anthrax, okay? Yeah, bullshit, but this is just hypothetical. Let's say it's that. What am I going to do with it? Why do I want it? You know? Just to keep it out of other people's hands, I guess. But, like, what am I going to do with it? I'm probably not going to use it. Because if it is something like that, it's probably heavy. I don't know. I just hope whatever it is, it's extremely useful to me. Oh, shit. These people are hostile. Let's kill you. Or miss. You know, that works, too. Sorry, Clinton. Clinton and Clint. Sorry, guys. Oh, no. That's just Survivor and Clinton. Rip these guys. Let's go ahead and make my water. Make some bandages. And we cannot cook. Let's go ahead and save real quick at the sleeping bag. And continue east. We're almost there. Kind of. I mean, you know, we'll probably get there. We're probably not going to get to the FMS Columbia today. I'll just say that. We'll probably get to Spectacle Island today, but hey, power armor. Hey, Mr. Gutsy. Never mind. Yeah, I'm not gonna try and deal with a Mr. Gutsy for a little bit of power armor. That is honestly just not worth it. Oh, there's a bear. I think this is the first time I've ever beelined this much. Like, even when I said I'm gonna beeline to Fort Hagen, I don't think I beelined this much. Oh, that reminds me. Somebody suggested that I should use Jet when I'm sneaking to sneak into Fort Hagen, right? Like, so I can dodge people? That's a pretty good idea, honestly. Using Jet to sneak in? I might do that. Uh, I still would like a... Let's go ahead and just kill this guy. I still would like... Mm, son of a bitch. A, uh, what is it called? A stealth boy. Just, you know, in case. But Jet is a nice backup. Let's kill the guy with the gun first. Oh, there's another one. Poke your head up, buddy. No, up. Okay, not like that, but okay. Did he just use up all of his ammo right then? I heard him shoot his gun, and then he switched immediately... He switched immediately to a melee weapon, so hopefully he has something. Also, yeah, there's kind of... There's a lot of cuts. I, I know. I know. A lot of background stuff happening. I do apologize, but hey. I try to smooth it out as best I can. Hopefully you guys don't mind too much. Alright, let's go ahead and save at this place. Ultra jet, jet fuel. Jet fuel's eh, less interesting, but I guess it's something. Well, so what trap does this do? Out of curiosity. Because if it's like a bomb, wouldn't that be more detrimental to yourself? Oh yeah, it is a bomb. See, I don't know. I, mm, if I were them, I don't think I'd use a bomb. I think I'd use one of the... Well, a bomb is, is more likely to get somebody, but the gun trap is more likely to not, you know, hit you. When I, if you put a bomb where you're sleeping, what if someone triggers that while you're asleep? The shrapnel might kill you. Like, see, I don't know, man. Think about this in a very logical way. Also, the Massachusetts Bay University. You want to be very careful around here. Because I'm sure that place has been repopulated since we've been here. We haven't been around this area for... 
insert big amount of numbers here. Month? Or two, maybe? I don't know, man. It's been a long time since we've been around here. Also, I've never been to that building. That one looks interesting. But nope, we're on a mission. And in fact, we might just go to the FMS Columbia today, because I don't know if I can wait. I'm really excited. I don't... Uh, man... I guess we'll see if it's if it's like a big thing, like a big combat situation or what. I don't even think we're gonna sleep, honestly, because it's still daytime. What time is it? 3.44 p.m. It's not late. I don't think we're even gonna sleep. I think we're just gonna go right for it. We can get onto the clump or uh, the Spectacle Island. Ooh, we don't wanna do that. Just because we can run faster once we're there, but I'm just gonna run for it, man. I'm curious to see what it has to offer. Also, there's something that's glowing under there. You see that? It's like... Right there? I don't know what that is. Also, that looks like... Oh, you know what? This is just south of Fort Independence, isn't it? Yeah, so... This is that place I never actually cleared out. That's fine. It didn't look like, really, there is too much there. Whoever was living there kind of abandoned it. At least, that's what it looked like to me. You can kind of see... The Spectacle Island shoreline. There's some trees. So, it's... It's hard to see, but we can kind of see it. I guess we'll stop off at my outpost just to save. But then I'm going right for the Columbia. As long as we have enough daylight, we should be fine. Because if it's underwater, you know, we're going to need daylight. I really hope it's not underwater, though, because that's the worst. I've got nothing that can help me breathe underwater. No power armor or anything. Wait, what's this? Wait, what? What is this? Wait, what the fuck? What is this? Uh, this is not something I saw when I was... Hello? I didn't see this when I was leaving. Um... I guess it's some sort of pumping station? Some... Or, I don't know what this is, actually. Huh. I don't know. My oil rig? Maybe? Uh, it's really tiny to be an oil rig, if you ask me, but I don't know. I have no idea. It's definitely- well, no, it can't be. It's too small. I don't know, it's some sort of- Maybe it's a purifier thing that purifies water? I have no idea. That's weird. I can't believe I didn't see that when I was leaving this place, though. Oh, and that reminds me, we could get my hunting rifle if I wanted to. You know, replace the Reba. Because that sounds like a good idea. Let's take a super underpowered, not modded- dumb gun and replace it with my super powerful 308 that can also be stopped with 50. Granted, so could the rifle, but whatever. Who cares? Let's just go sleep. I think the outpost... Is that it? No, the outpost is on the southern side of the island. We'll go sleep, or record in the journal, rather. We'll just save, and then we'll head right out to FMS Columbia, because I really want to see what's out there. If it is a combat situation, though, like, we have to fight, I don't know if I'm going to do it today. We'll see. There's that fat man we had a while ago. Alright, FMS Columbia. We've been tracking you for a long, long time. And now it's finally time to see what it's all about. This is what we've been doing everything for. The FMS Columbia. Oh shit, it's not sunken. Uh-oh. There's definitely gonna be people on it. Wait. Was this even... Did this spawn when I went? I don't even know if this was even here. Like, could we even have gone to this before? I don't know. Whatever. Please don't get shot, really. I'm a bit nervous. I thought it was going to be submerged, but I'm actually happy to see it's not, because I hate going underwater. It's just terrible in Fallout 4. I don't think Vats works in the water, so I'm just spamming Vats to see if I don't get killed, but... If there's somebody on here... I don't think there's too much I can do about it. I see a light. I can't tell if that's a person, though. Hello? This is it. Looks like it's empty. I have no idea, though. I'm really freaking out here. Wait. Wait a minute. Oh, shit. The Columbia's underwater. <gasps> This isn't the Columbia. This is the... Wait, no, maybe this is the Columbia, because there are police boats. I thought this was, like, maybe the, re the the boat that was, like... Um, what is it called? 
recovering the Columbia that sunk, but no, 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 I think this is it. Just be really careful, there could be traps. It's really eerie. It's a lot different than I was expecting, honestly. I like the police boats, though, they look cool. Um, you know what, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna save, because we might have to go underwater for this thing. Don't know, though. Let's throw down the camping... sleeping bag. Hmm. I assume this is the cargo holds? Well, I'd assume if the police caught him, there's no way that the thing that we're looking for would still be on the ship, right? I mean, why would that be there? They would have taken it, right? That would make sense. Hmm. I'm not seeing anything. It, there must be something under the water. There must be. Oh, see, look. Okay. Let's try and follow this down, see where it leans. I really do not like going under this, though. Is that a crash river? There's no way! This thing is huge! What? I'm gonna have to bring power armor. Wait a minute, no, let's go up. I'm still not drowning. So yeah, that was a pretty good amount of time. There's no fucking way though. Like, holy shit, this is a big thing! This is a freighter! So, we're looking for a biological weapon? Well, here's the Columbia's wreck. We found it. Alright, let's go back up. I don't know, man. Can we even stay under for long enough? I wonder if Aqua Boy is helping me at all. I didn't get the second Aqua Boy perk, but it does feel like I'm not late. I, I, it feels like I would have been drowning a lot faster than I am. So, I don't know. I think second level of Aqua Boy is what gives you the immunity from drowning, though. So, I don't know. I'm imagining that the thing I'm looking for would not be in the cabins now I think about it. It's probably going to be in the cargo. I'm just going to go ahead and do this until I drown, just so I can scout out as much as possible. Unless there's like a pocket of air somewhere. I doubt it though. That's what we're going to have to do. Just trial and error until we find what we're looking for. I did see an open thing over here though. Oh, and I'm drowning. Yeah, I'm dead. That's okay though. We found, well, we searched a lot of it. So, yeah, the Columbia is a giant underwater wreck. We might need to bring power armor. Mm. Let's try again. Or we have to get Aqua Boy 2. That's another thing. I mean, maybe it's something in this. This looks like a plane or something. Like a wrecked. I don't know what this is. A vertebrate? Is this a vertebrate? Yeah, it's a vertebrate. God, is it hard to see. Okay. This is a big-ass ship, though. Alright, we found the Columbia again. Let's go back up. God, this thing is huge. Alright, so maybe it's in the cargo hold? There's nothing I have that can give me water breathing, right? Hardly see. I don't think there's anything I have that can give me water breathing. Hmm. Let's just see. Vertibirds crashed. I would assume it would be in the cargo over here. Because if you're smuggling something, that's where you transport it, right? Alright, up. All the way up. I think I'm right over where I need to be. Please get up. There we go. Okay, let me check something. Is there like an interior anywhere around here by any chance? No. Wow, this is actually a really detailed local map though for the local map in Fallout 4, I gotta say. Alright, back down we go. I have a feeling we're not gonna find what we're looking for today. It's just gonna take too long. Oh, 
Oh my god. This is the end of the ship. That's radiation. This is ridiculously big. Maybe it is in the cabin. I don't know, man. I'll try and go on the raised side of the ship. I'm gonna go down a few more times and then I think we might have to call it for today. Just really wish I had something that I could breathe underwater with. I, ugh, I need to get power armor. The one thing power armor is actually going to help me with. And to think, I said power armor is never going to be useful. Oh, what's this? It's a hole. This actually might be where I'm looking. We're in the cargo hold. I wish there was like a pocket air down here. That'd be fucking fantastic. Okay, well that's the cargo hold. Let's go back up again. I'm gonna go back down into the cargo hold. Oh, don't drown. <sighs> this is harsh. This is really harsh. Oh wait, this isn't even it. There it is. Uh, I don't think the cargo hold has anything. I think it's just rotted out. Maybe it's over here? No, it's just radiation. Oh my god, I can hardly see things normally. Now it expects you to find something underwater. I'm gonna drown now. Yeah, rip. Alright. I think we're gonna end today's survival here, though. Next time, we're just gonna keep diving again until we can find something. So I anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.